What's up guys and welcome back to another episode here on NRV Outdoors. Today we're here at one of our favorite trophy trout streams to talk about a really awesome bait that slays fish, especially big trout during the winter months. And that is the Powerbait Atomic Teasers. As you can see here guys, we've got a three pack of the pearl white with a little yellow tail Powerbait Atomic Teasers. These are just very simple little mini tube jigs with a small little power worm inserted that absolutely slay fish be it under the ice are in these cold mountain creeks all winter long guys so in today's video we're going to talk about this this will be the topic of our video we're going to fish them around we're going to catch as many as we can we're going to talk about my favorite ways to fish these and uh, we're going to have a lot of fun so go ahead and stick around and let's get started all right guys in today's video we have got the lose mock pearl combo here with our eight pound 100 percent fluorocarbon line and we're just going to simply tie ourselves up one of these little atomic teasers here to start out our day we'll just reach in here grab out that first one reseal up our pack here and there we go one more look at those now there's several knots that will work really well with these little jigs here you can tie your fisherman's knot and improve clinch knot and eh, the sky's the limit but I would say my personal favorite would have to be the polymer knot and I'm going to show you guys quickly how to tie that you just simply run your line right through your eye just like that take your string and run it back through your eye once more just like so creating a nice big loop here to your right hand side then you're simply going to tie these two uh, sections together as if you was going to tie your shoe pulling your loop out just like that there then you're just simply going to take your little mini jig and run him right back through that loop just like so and then simply pinch the shank of your hook here grab your tag in give it a bit of a tug once you feel it go tight and moisten it with some saliva your four carbon will burn otherwise then just simply pull that tag in until your knot comes tight and the reason i really like this polymer knot guys is it will put a double clinch onto your hook there which will allow this little mini jig to stay at this 90 degree angle as it fishes through the water column there and it's just absolutely perfect we'll go ahead and snip off our excess here and pop that into our pocket and as you can see there guys just a beautiful little bait very easy to use extremely in line it's got a nice little weight inside once again it's got that little power worm attached nice little hook there and that polymer knot will keep it at that perfect 90 degree angle allowing it to bounce down the water column just like that so let's not waste any time guys let's go ahead and hop in this creek and let's see how many we can catch there we go there we go there's one on the old teaser heck yeah that one absolutely crushed it absolutely crushed it just tossing it over there and jigging it back there we go guys big angry girl there oh looks like she kicked the teaser in the net let's just let her take off right there there we go heck yeah and there's fish number one down guys a little bit of destruction on our teaser but not too bad and gorgeous fish number one to start off our day heck yeah let's go ahead and get back in here guys we'll just keep jigging along and we'll see if we can't turn us up another one so no bites in a few minutes now one of my favorite aspects about the atomic teaser in my opinion is that you can replace your little segment of power worm with whatever color you want and my favorite color and i'm sure is probably a lot of your guys's favorite color is most likely going to be that pink but in this situation instead of just the plain hot pink i'm going to try out the pink with a little bit of a white bottom here as you can see right there we're just going to rig it right on up our, on our mini jig just like that yellow one was run him down and out poke him right up underneath the skirt just like that nice little presentation and all we had to do was simply reach in our pack and change out our color and that makes this bait so diverse and so awesome and that's really why i picked that pearl color guys because that white you can really see it down there especially in these winter months when that water is super clear you can see the fish chase it really really well and then you can add whatever color you want that you may feel confident in or that you feel like they may bite better now for you guys that fish under the ice this is a must have in your box guys these little jigs to fish vertically are just phenomenal and anybody who's tried them under the ice most likely carries them every time they go but 
for me personally i love them out here during these winter months while the creek's nice and clear and cold and the fish are hungry and trying to get a fat belly to stay warm during the cold nights Oh, there we go guys right out from under this bush oh big jump oh that was just too epic right there guys casting around that little atomic teaser right out from under this bush and this big beauty right here came over and absolutely slapped it guys that's the thing about trout as big as this fish is she was just in the tiniest tiniest little spot hiding out staying safe and had we not made that cast there guys we would have never known she was in there and if i had to bet i would say there's a chance she even has a friend in there heck yeah all right guys we'll just let that little beauty swim right on out of the net right here at our feet oh she's right here at our feet i bet you we can net her again she's so silly yep there she goes okay she made it out of there heck yeah so we'll just check on our little atomic teaser see what the damage is looks like not much it is getting a little worn from two fish but let's just go ahead and pop him right back in this little run right here because that was surprisingly effective really quickly and it's a decent chance there may be another one in there Ooh, big one in there big nice one in there drop that old atomic teaser right on in there and see what he thinks here he comes oh he thought about it try him again right here here he comes oh thought about it again i believe we're going to get this fish right here guys how we'll get him in the net i'm not too sure there we go we got him on all right now comes the fun part we got to get this big girl in the net oh she is not a little one either not at all. Ooh, fighter. Fighter. Oh, gosh, she is so angry. All right, now how are we going to get this big girl in our net? I'm thinking we can maybe slide down this bank. It looks like a hard bottom on the opposite side. So as you guys know, we'll do about anything for the safety of our fish there we go guys we just slid on down the bank to get down here with her the safety of this fish is what's important we want her to be happy and healthy as she's released so we took a tumble on down the bank there but that's okay we got her in the net we'll now be able to release her happy and healthy kind of knew it was a bad call to set the hook up there on top of that heel but it's hard to resist guys especially when you're looking down at one that size take off little girl there she goes right on back upstream she's going to find her little place to nestle up and uh, looks like we completely destroyed our teaser so we're either going to get rigged back up or we're going to see if we can just find us another one here and we'll see what happens guys go ahead and stick around Ooh, 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 guys no no action needed that fish just came over and got it just like that yes there we go we had to get back up here on top of this bank so unfortunately we will be making a trip back down we'll let her fight for a second don't need her making no big runs while we're heading down there wow guys that is just too much fun back-to-back -back catches in the same little spot right here I did have to get back up here to get a good eye on them, but all right, looks like she's wearing out some. I'm going ahead and slide ourselves right on into the creek just like before. There we go, guys. This bank is probably five foot tall. It's about a foot shorter than I am. And we're sliding right on down it for these big beautiful fish on the old atomic teaser. 
Heck yeah. Just too much fun. There we go. Slid her right on into the net. We did uh, retie with a fresh teaser. And we left that old yellow tail on there. That fish has still got plenty of fight left in him. Angry in the net. There we go. But uh, we left the uh, yellow worm in it, as you can see there. And this little beauty here did not seem to mind it. See if we can just get her popped off nice and easy there. We'll just let her swim out of the net right here. Take off, little girl. There she goes, right at our feet, guys, right here. Heck yeah. Well, that fish managed to hook me a little bit, so we'll uh, take care of that, and we'll see if we can't get us another one. Heck yeah. All righty, guys, that's pretty much going to do it for today's video with the old Atomic Teaser. We ended up catching five fish total, four of them on camera, and had an absolute blast. And I highly recommend, while we got these nice winter months and this crystal clear water, almost nationwide, that you get out there, you buy you a pack of Atomic Teasers, and you hit it hard. But until next time, boys and girls, get out if you can and do some fishing and have some fun. But most importantly, be safe and tight lines.